Welcome back to We Happy Few Lightbringer DLC. Wait, not Lightbringer. Lightbearer? Yeah, Lightbearer. Eh, close enough, right? So we are in the bar, the hotel bar. Last episode, we replaced our soggy amp with a proper amp. And now we're here to, I think, just get drunk? But apparently Nick recognizes the song that's playing and we need to investigate it. The song in my dream. Yoink. They're either a terrible player or that piano is severely out of tune. No but pickles. Can't to see your old band mate Mori. Wondering how I fared since you tossed me for the band. No. I'm merely in proximity to the bar. You look like hell, by the way. I suppose they tart you up a bit for the pictures, do they? Um, that song you were playing just now. I just need to hear the rest of that song. This? Just a new bit I'm trying to work up. Mostly to irritate her. You'd think that a dancer would be musical. But Dossie only likes bubblegum pop. Did I mention she's a fan of yours, Nick? No, not that. What you were playing before? Da 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 da. That. Why? To get your jollies mocking me? No, I just think it was very, um, catchy. Do you think Virgil might like it? He'd, um, be all over it. Yeah, he'd be in pieces. He'd bloody love it to death. Um, I'd be glad to put in a good word when I see him. Oh, but, but, but I can't play it for you today. Why the fuck not? Sorry. Trollop stole my piano tuner. Said it sounds better that way. I can't be out of tune for my big break. Not when so much is riding on my perfection. <laughs> for fuck's sake. Look, what if I just steal it back for you? You do that? You must be eager to hear me play. Dotty is staying in the Shangri last week. You've never had much trouble getting into birds hotel rooms, have you? Murray Mamento. Headliner. While she's dancing, I'll just sneak into her room. Lucky I still have that billboard gig. <laughs> Are they stirring? At this pool table as if it's like a game of chess. Appreciation Society. Minutes of the General Assembly of the Nick Lightbearer Fan Club. Number one, a reading of minutes from previous meeting. Unfortunately, this took a rather long time due to their having been trampled at the conclusion of last year's assembly when a passing Nick impersonator was mistaken for the genuine article. Number two, resolution voted passed to acknowledge September 3rd, date of Nick's most recent divorce, as Nick Lightbearer Emancipation Day. <laughs> what the fuck? Number three, members pledged to purchase at least 10 copies of Nick's newest record, regardless of their preferences regarding this phase of his career. Number four, meeting concluded when, as in past years, a Nick impersonator was spotted outside the conference room and a stampede ensued. Impersonator proved to merely be a passing gentleman with a mustache. Missing lookalikes. Have you seen them? Description. Shaggy do. Svelte mustache. Striped pants. Guitar. Look just like Nick, but they're not Nick. Hmm. Good luck. I'm slightly desperate for any additional supplies, because I have two toasted chicory and one thing of scotch, and that's it. Ooh. Okay, take the lift to the dancer's floor. Not entirely sure where that is, to be honest. Does this have quest markers? I don't think it does. And there's no map I can open either. Oh, here it is. Must keep a clear head. No drugs today, no reds, and especially no yellows. Oh, party favors. 
Maybe I'll quit some other less stressful day. I'm, I'm still myself on drugs, right? Just a bit more fabulous. I'd never do anything actually heinous, would I? Ouch. <laughs> I'll never do I'll anything never actually, actually heinous. <laughs> I'm not sure what I can do differently. This whoa, this is as fast as I can go. Maybe I just need to go faster? Like just move quick enough so that I can get here before they get me? Yeah. I just didn't move fast enough before. Oh god, everything is reversed. I mean, the controls are reversed, not just everything in the world. So right with my mouse makes my character go left, down, goes up, left, with the movement goes right. Oh boy. Don't be Foggy Jack. Don't be Foggy Jack. Don't be Foggy Jack. Those drug tripping sequences are honestly just fantastic. Really cool. Look, 
around a little bit first. Okay. Yeah. That was nice. Good little search. Lightbearer! You... You were downstairs. I am upstairs, aren't I? My head's a little foggy. Oh, that's my twin, Dotty. I'm Dodo, the smart one. Oh, hello. Um, <laughs> I'm just here for a piano tuna. She asked me to fetch it, as one does. Oh, I bet you could slay a girl. Why? What What have you heard? You're trouble. You need a girl like me to tame you. Oh, I love to tame a bad boy. Oh, it gives a girl such a sense of satisfaction. Uh, look, love, um, <laughs> I'll, I'll just get that tuna and, uh, go. <laughs> You'll have to entertain me first. Do as I say, or Nanny will smack. Well, wow, those friends came pretty fast. <laughs> Hello, my lovelies. <laughs> that dance seems a bit tame for a bad boy. Uh, is this... Naughty enough for you. Yeah! This'll give your dancing more energy! Oh! Spank! 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 Flower gyrate all around. <laughs> Wait, pick up the piano tuner. Where, where exactly is it, though? That, that's a piano tuner? This thing? Fixes out of tune pianos, but does nothing to improve their players. Oh, it's just a tool to. Uh... Oh, I don't. Hmm. I had no idea how tuning a piano actually worked. I'd never really thought about it. It's not a thing to tell whether a piano is out of tune, it's a thing to adjust the piano when you know it's out of tune. No, um, well, uh, maybe the stairs this time.
Got your piano tuner, mate. Came through, didn't I? Oh, aren't you eager to please? Worried I'll forget you when I'm on top, the way you did me. But I'm a bigger man than you. Hey, I'll even let you play back up. Oh, well, uh, it's uh, very generous, mate. Uh, now, would you play the song, please? You really want it? Please, I'm uh, feverish in anticipation. <laughs> Memento composition. I uh, know I've heard it. Fine. I heard someone humming it on the roof last night, but I did put my own spin on it. The roof? I made it my own. That takes talent too. Hey, hey, you'll still talk to Virgil for me, won't you? I have to go. I knew it. You never help anyone but yourself. You're a scoundrel and a fraud, Norbert Pickles. And, and, you look silly in puff sleeves. Their head did some really weird things there. Service lift to rooftop. Where is this service lift? Probably in the hotel lobby? Oh, this is open now. Yeah, it's in there. Room service order, Wonderland Suite. Order received 2.33 a.m. 13 bottles of Vermoth, 7 of absinthe, 12 quails and aspic. Oh my god, 36 scotch eggs. A cauldron of jellied eels. All for me, apparently. It's not quite a rooftop spa, is it? <laughs> what the hell? Can I reach the others from here? I don't think I can. I think I gotta jump to the first one. Yeah, they do bounce. Which ones am I missing? Oh. Oh, 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 oh. buttons that I'm missing. These kind of look like buttons here, but they don't do anything. I mean, I don't think I need to disable them, really. I think I can just go. Yeah. A trail of blood. shop owner murdered last night when I don't remember where I was oh they were my prime suspect so I guess they aren't foggy Jack
taunting letter. Gentlemen of the constabulary, it's been delightful to watch your impassioned efforts these past few weeks. What zeal, what dedication to justice. What rubbish. You may have passed me in the street and tipped your charming cap. We may have stood shoulder to shoulder in the loo. I could truly be anywhere, and you wouldn't have a clue. What's certain is that you'll be seeing more of me and my work. A good deal more. Aren't you tickled? I know I am. Yours, ever so ticklishly, F.J. The bellboy suit. Was I... Left your clothes lying about again. You naughty little lamb. I was here. Finally. Something jogs your memory. No. No, no, no. I don't want to remember. I don't want to remember. It's the end. It comes to the end. Oh, oh yeah. Hello. How'd you get here, love? <laughs> Bribed the manager, did you? <laughs> uh, but uh... oh, oh dear. Oh fuck. Oh, not again, mate. At this rate, soon you'll have no fans left at all. Oh, tell me I didn't do this. My days are telling you what you want to hear. Oh, We're over. Maybe I'm possessed. Wait, did, did I ever make a deal with the devil? <laughs> if you'd done that, you'd actually be talented, wouldn't you? <laughs> then... I really am... a killer. I, I've got to hide myself away, so I don't hurt anyone else. My drugs made me a monster. Or maybe... I really am a monster. I don't mean to slow things down too much, but we have some very, very alarming lyrics. Kill all fans, kill them all. Okay. Hmm. No more party favors. Ever. I can never do this again. I don't know if this is the way I'm supposed to go. <laughs> Lookalike seems to have gone missing. Oh, the look like me contest. I'll win this pretty easily. I like this change that they've made. They've made it so that I can't take uh, joy or scotch anymore. Just toasted chicory. Right, because Nick wants to keep their head clear. Wait! Stop! I need to tell you something! It's not your turn, sweetie. But it's me, Nick. I'm dangerous. I'm bad. I'm pure evil. That's trying a bit too hard, I'm afraid. See, we want a Nick who seems dangerous, but in a cheerful, non-threatening way. Next! Listen! You don't sing like Nick! You don't even look like Nick! Whoa! Oh, good sign. Smart 
over the camera, Nick. <laughs> Oh wait, I can't. Hmm, it won't let me get any more of these. Uh-oh. Oh, I should not have come in here. Let me through! There we go, now it's working. Still just having the best time of their life up there. How do I get away from people? to the basement. Oh, this looks bad. I knew I hated myself, but... all my things jog any memories virch oh oh look I, I know i've been a shit to you and still you don't remember oh, i know i said i'd kill you a time or, or two and i wasn't kind to petunia and other people but but not not a murderer Th does none of this ring a bell not even a little tinkle you're right I can't hide from this, can I? Oh, I've got to turn myself in. Could it be the hotel owner, manager, whatever they are? Remember the note we read from them saying that they make money when Nick comes here and everybody stays at their place, but it's a, just a shit show and they hate it and it's super stressful? Calm down, Nikki. Calm down. Calm down. Where is this elevator going? Oh, fuck. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh! I think we're in hell now. Oh, you literally. It says exit hell. 
Oh, that lava looks so nice. Oh, what is this place? Oh, I don't like what I'm thinking. Please be a way out. Hey, Virgil. Am I in hell? No, 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 no. I wanted to be better. I just wasn't. I can't be damned for something I can't even remember. I, I took all those drugs. So, so I wouldn't know how bad I was. And I, t I turned into something so much worse. I know why I'm here. I killed Virgil, didn't I? I've been expecting you for ages. Oh, fuck! It's the devil! I've had my eye on you for such a long time. Fuck, 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 I hope my guitar knows. It's always got me out of trouble before. I can tell they had so much fun making this. They really just went all out creating just the most wild visuals. This maze. Oh fuck. Please don't torment me for all eternity. I don't even remember. Oh, you don't remember. What just happened with her hair? Gosh, I, I must say I'm disappointed. I did my best work to impress you. Impress me? Then you aren't the devil? Oh, if only. <laughs> One tries, you know. You're Foggy Jack. Well, yes. <laughs> Everyone's heard of good old Foggy Jack, eh? What do you want with me? I was rather hoping you'd write a song about me. You know, after I killed all your peskiest fans. Well, that means I, 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 I didn't kill anyone. I was a witness. I'm not irredeemable. I mean, okay, I have been fairly shit, but I'm not you! Au contraire, Nick, I think we're just alike. Fans aren't enough, are they? The real you disappoints them, doesn't it? But when you gut them in the fog, then you have their attention, don't you? <laughs> no, 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 no. You really won't be my friend? You're bloody mental! Then you can be my next trophy. <laughs> <laughs> He's throwing masks. <laughs> See how they run. See how they Oh my god. They're so cute. Oh, no, this is a hotel maze. There's a stage on the other side of the maze, if I remember right. I'll kill all your 
of pan. All be left to remember you then, eh? No! You can't kill all my fans. Oh, you're really mental. Stop him. Nicky, you've got to stop him. <laughs> oh, the ants! <laughs> yes! <laughs> oh, they're not <laughs> okay, so I need to uh, power them. Oh, so much toasted chicory. Why can't I go up the steps? Oh, we need to hit that button. Okay. Um, there's more. Now to plug in and rock and roll. Stagecraft for your fans. But why not have a dress rehearsal, eh? <laughs> your concert will be to your hot ticket! <laughs> ah, so each one I blow up goes back to them. Oh. Or if this is gonna work. Nice. Oh, oh, they didn't blow him up. I just like paused him. Oh. Oh. So cute. Oh. 
Charge face melt or your golden records. Killed my fans. And Virgil, for what? The bloody notoriety? Avenge me, Nikki. Turn it up to 11. Finish him. Yes, finish him. This one's for Virgil. Let's finish off with some thoughts on the Lightbringer DLC. I really enjoyed it and I'm really impressed by it. My worst fear is that it would basically be more of the same with just a different character, some different quests, but otherwise it would be very repetitive. I was fearing I might have to play through basically the whole game again, it would be super long and get really boring and samey, but it didn't do that at all, it is completely different. It's very short. I mean, not overly short, but way shorter than the main game. The things you actually do, though, as far as like looting and how combat works and things like that are completely different and completely tailored to Nick Lightbear as a character and things that make sense for them. They don't have any melee weapon at all. They can just throw out records and then they have the really cool guitar blowing people's mind thing. 
Rather conveniently, actually, this DLC gets rid of one of my biggest problems with the original game, which is way, 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 way too many things to loot, to the point where I just mash E on everything. But there's actually not that much here to loot at all. I think just aside from quest items, I think there's just three items other than that that you regularly use, scotch, joy, and toasted chicory. And that was fantastic. That was refreshing. Everything takes place on a much smaller scale. There isn't a big open world at all. You can't even open your map. Again, everything is really tailored specifically to this character and, and the story that they made for them. And it worked brilliantly. I can tell that a lot of consideration went into how to make, basically how to redesign the game for this DLC, rather than just using the same exact framework that they used before, which is really appreciated. And aside from the whole haha look at this person who has a lot of trouble with substance abuse aside from that not being good everything else is really good i mean it has once again just like the base game fantastic voice acting really god the voice acting of nick lightbear is just so hilarious it's got fantastic and really funny cutscenes, and really cool set pieces too I, it's visually really exciting. There's just all sorts of weird experimental stuff going on all the time with all the different drug trips and how you're always kind of passively tripping. Just stare up at the sky and there's weird shapes everywhere and everything kind of slowly swims in your vision. It's just really interesting visuals. And then going to hell, for example, and all those things. They just really had a lot of fun making totally different weird wacky locations. Yeah, I thought it was fantastic and, and really refreshing. So I hope you have enjoyed so far, and I'm not done yet. When I return, we're going to play the base game as Sally.
talk in the dark.